money. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? No, they doing it. That's their pleasure. They they doing it uh, together as a team. I, I just don't, I, yeah, the lines are very blurred, very yeah. blurred. Yeah, no, nah, man, I agree because I think too, something else that's truly just being exposed right now is all the people that's been around Puff and now all of a sudden people are trying to back off from him. But it's just like just two years ago, I believe, BET Lifetime Achievement Award. Just last year, InvestFest wrote a check. He's the keynote speaker. But then I'm like, everybody used to always joke about Puff potentially being gay. Ever since I was a kid, I remember people, they would always say, Stuff like that. But then now, all of a sudden, no Diddy, right? Everybody's saying that. But then the same people that's saying this, I seen you around him. It's the same thing with Trump. Trump is now racist. Of course, Trump has been wilding, yes. But all the rappers, they were just with Trump five, six years ago. Trump ain't racist to me. See, I'm, I'm not one with Trump hate That's a whole spin. No, you know I'm I've been in the industry 30 yeah. years. Mm -hmm. Trump been around us the whole 30 years. Mm -hmm. I've seen him invest in Jesse Jackson's campaign. He did, yeah. I, I've seen him invest in so much black stuff. Mm. And let's not just forget, right before he ran for president, he had the apprentice. He did. He and brought the old that. Arsenio yep. Hall back. Yep. How much money you got, Arsenio Hall, from uh, uh, Donald Trump celebrity apprentice? Tara Owens. Uh, Terrell yeah. Owens, yeah. Little John, no. Omarosa, NeNe Leakes, mm. Claudia Jordan. Mm. Uh, I could go on Tito Jackson. I could go on for days, Bo Jackson. I could go on for days, all the black people that Trump helped, uh, ha, uh, Holly Robinson Pete. I could go on for days, all the millions y'all all made off of the celebrity princess. And ain't none of you, Tyra Banks. I ain't even seen name one of y'all say that Trump was racist when y'all was up there getting all that money for y'all goddamn charities. So as soon as he run for president, y'all run the race card just to help these Democrats win. Y'all ain't shit. Choked to hey, choke going in. Hey, man, that's what we got you here for, brother. And I think that same that same logic applies Wait, towards Puff. It may, nah, it may I, please. Of course. That's why you're here. You good. You fake ass motherfuckers, Ciroc boys, <laughs> DJ SNS, and all y'all niggas. Puff my brother. Puff my brother. I ain't seen near one of y'all bitch ass niggas motherfucking at the courthouse with his sons. Are you a dope creative looking to further monetize your content? Well, let me tell you about Peep. Peep is the best new revolutionary platform for creatives by creatives. You can set custom pricing for your content where you can get the full monetization for what you do. On top of that, you can set custom payment dates so you don't have to wait till the 21st of the month like YouTube. You can get paid when you want, how you want. And on top of that, you can meet with fellow creatives that are doing similar things such as you to take what you do to the next level. I'm telling you guys, Peep is what's next. Unlike Patreon, you can customize each piece of your content. Every episode, every song, BTS content, photography, videography, and so much more. If you're ready to get started, you can use this QR code right here and also the link in my bio. And every single time that you refer fellow creatives, you can monetize that as well. I'm telling you guys, Peep is what's next. Tap in and I cannot wait to see you guys over there. Peace. Puff was your brother. Those, these was your nephews, and y'all ain't got no moral support for these kids. And I know they grown men, and I'm calling them kids. Pac and Big died at 24, 25. They was kids to us now, right? Ain't none of y'all niggas. Buster, uh, Jay-Z, LL, none of y'all niggas got no moral support. Ray J, all y'all punk ass niggas. Y'all ain't got no moral support for Puff kids to walk with them in that courtroom. Mary J. Blige, Naomi Campbell, none of y'all. I don't care what that nigga did. All y'all was running with that nigga. All y'all was at his parties. Jermaine Dupree, Usher. All y'all party with this nigga. Terrence J., all y'all niggas party with Puff. And none of y'all sat there and went. All y'all DJs that got a check. Ciroc boy, niggas. It's Kenny Burns. All y'all. Ain't none of y'all gonna go to court for this nigga? Y'all know what it mean to go to court and support people? I don't care what he charged for. That nigga ain't raped nobody. He ain't killed nobody.
And I'm not defending Diddy. Whatever's going to happen, it happen. Where all y'all niggas that was partying with this nigga, if he was throwing a party, all y'all niggas would be there right fucking now. All y'all. Ain't none of y'all show up to the courtroom for this nigga? And Sean, you full of shit, nigga. You a chameleon. You with that fake ass Belizean accent, nigga. You was in, in fucking Rikers Island for 10 years. Where the hell you get this heavy ass Belizean accent? You from Brooklyn, nigga. And now all oh, you saying all this shit about Puff? Nigga, you was just on stage with that nigga. Two years ago, if it was two years ago. Now he this and now he that. Y'all, you a fake ass nigga. You went to jail, you became a blood. You came out, you was fucking Jewish, running around with sideburns and all this shit. And now you got this heavy ass Belizean accent. You done get turned a politician, came over back into the country, was hanging with Diddy. You was at his house, my nigga. Just because he did sucker shit to you, you ain't got to be a sucker, Sean. Fake ass, heavy ass, Belizean accent. That nigga, he, yo, that nigga's a chameleon, bro. That nigga phony as a motherfucker. That's my nigga, I love him, but he phony, bro. That nigga was just over here with Khaled and all them niggas. In Miami. Khaled, why the fuck you ain't at court? Rick Ross, why you ain't at court? All y'all phony ass niggas. Y'all know he need that support. If all y'all niggas that party, that gave him support with them parties, was in that courtroom, he'd have a better chance. Y'all niggas seen that nigga kick that girl in that fucking CNN video, and y'all niggas ran like roaches. That shit was eight years ago. Y'all niggas was still hanging out with that nigga. That fucking video ain't new. That shit is old, niggas. And y'all all partied with him for the last fucking six years since that video. Y'all some phony ass niggas. Y'all niggas better show up to that courtroom and get that nigga some mother... That nigga's son, some support. They, they ain't got their fucking mother no more, niggas. Phony ass uncles. And they may even get in trouble. We don't know. But shout out to Quincy, Christian, and Justin. Y'all, all y'all fake uncles. Y'all see all y'all fake uncles? Ain't nobody. Y'all niggas can't walk in out that car room by yourself. No Buster Rhymes. None of them niggas. But them niggas that come party and drink free liquor, phony ass niggas, pardon my rant, man. Nah, bro, this is why you here, Choke. Hey, my job is just to ask the question, sit back, and let you cook, man. To your point of people being at these parties, I remember Issa Rae had made a post maybe like two years ago now talking about having fun at a puff party and partying with puff. And to your point, it's so interesting now because now nobody even wants to talk about being at puff's parties. To your point. Because they all scared. And that's what I'm about to get to. Cook. Why are they scared, Cho? And also, what was going down at these was, parties? They was partying. Yes. What was, was happening partying. at these parties? We, I don't know. I ain't never been in the after after party. Right. But Puff throw great parties. Yeah, the regular yeah. parties. And that's what he's known for. He's yeah. the king. Yeah. Everybody wanted to be at a Puffy party. Right. Whether it was a white party, a birthday party, a, 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 a Grammy party. A, a BET party, or Emmy party, whatever he threw. Mm -hmm. Everybody knew he was the cream of the crop when it came to parties. Yeah. But there's that whole other element. You know what I'm saying? Where the, these niggas is all a bunch of homosexuals mm -hmm. undercover, and they don't want everybody to know. Some of these niggas got wives, yeah. and they fucking doing that shit. Yeah. I'm, I'm a nigga, my career was hindered mm -hmm. because they need, these niggas couldn't fuck me. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. I can't get the executive role because these niggas is all doing some weirdo shit, you know what I'm saying, and getting high shit. I don't get high. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So I can't be a part of that circle. But you see, ev everybody, this is why he has no support because all the motherfuckers that was in the cesspool with him, they now scared that he might get their asses up, and he should. 
because the motherfuckers ain't there to support them. I'll fucking be Nino Brown on them niggas. Just start telling on all y'all <laughs> niggas, y'all ain't gonna come and support me? Mm. But if I have a party, y'all all there. Mm. And then when I'm at my worst, ain't nobody there? Mm. Let him beat that shit. And they'll be all back up under his ass. Mm. Now, nah, Puff, you know, I, you know, I, you know, I had some shit. I had to protect I my image. You know, I yeah. couldn't take that chance. Like, yeah. get the fuck out of here. Mm.